Oh, McDonald had a farm. Sing it! Boys, can you sing it for me? E-I-E-I-O On a farm he had some ducks. Here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack, quack. His farm he had some chickens. E-I-E-I-O <laughs> <laughs> Hello everybody! So this week we are going to go for our first RV trip! We're gonna take the boys with us so it's gonna be fun new videos, fun new things that we're gonna do and explore. I don't know what Wally's trying to get from under the sofa over there. But yep, our Christmas tree is up. We're gonna put a new video on that as well. Let me give them some treats. Here you go, Zazu. Wally, are you looking for the treat? Here you go. Zazu wants more. Always wants more. So let's get into our RV. We've packed up air. We just need to introduce it to the boys now. Let's see how they react to it. So this is our camper van. Looks something like this. You've got your uh, table over here, a good size se seating arrangement. You can turn this table uh, into a bed. So if you have more people, you can turn that into a bed. But here's the bed that we have over here. It's a pretty good size. It's got a fridge, a mini fridge, some place where you can hang all your clothes, some more space over there. Good lighting, has a vent fan over there. And this is the kitchen area. It has two stoves, a sink with all these amenities. A microwave which just works with electricity. You need to uh, wire it to an electric source, which we won't have. But anyways, this is what it looks like. You check your water pump that turns the water on. This is the battery life. This is the fresh water we have. This is the black water, which is from the bathroom, toilet. And this is the gray water, which is from uh, things like the kitchen sink and just washing your hands and all that kind of stuff. It has a heater over there. A lot of stuff that you can use while uh, cooking. You can put stuff here. Got a lot of area over here to put in other stuff that we might need. And this is the toilet, shower, whatever. So this is the toilet and that's the shower head that we use. It's a really tiny space, but when you're on the road, that's all you get. Okay. So I'll turn that off. And we have all this huge space for the driver and the passenger. I guess someone can sit in here, but it would be pretty uncomfortable. But that is the space in front. This is a huge space in the back where the doggies sit. This has got bedding for the back, some camping chairs. We've got the snow chain and all of that, but the dogs sit here when we're driving. We don't want to put them in the back because they'd get nervous from all the moving. So yep, that is a tour of our camper van. Come on, Wally! Oh, Wally is already wanting to be on the bed. <laughs> what the heck, Wally? Oh, Zazu is not a big fan of new things. Whoa! Whoa! He's not a bad, big fan of new adventures. <laughs> Especially new automobiles. He hates them. Zazu! Yeah. Zazu, do you like it? Come here, Zazu. Come on, Papa. Go there. Papa, Wally. Go. Papa. Okay, you like just want to sit over there. Okay. That's fine, too. Can you go up, Zazu? He's like, how did this automobile become like a room? He's a little surprised. Wally is like, ah, oh, I like this. Zazu, not so much. He's gonna get used to it, isn't he? Isn't he?
stopping by at the Noyo Headlands Trail. And look at the size of that crow. Humongous. Oh. Okay. Is that Wally's gonna go get that crow? Come on. So we decided to come to the Mendocino Coast Botanical Garden, which is pretty famous around here. We can see a lot of pretty flowers and plants that we want to take home, but we're going to be on this trip for a week. I don't know if it's going to survive in the camper van. We got some decorative jellyfish over here. Remember, Wally, you picked them up from the ocean? Jellyfish? Poisonous jellyfish! So this is the glass beach in Fort Bragg. You can see their colorful pebbles, glass over here. There's not, there's not a lot of sand, but colorful pebbles. We didn't get the dogs down here because we don't want their to get cut from the glass that's the last thing I want but yeah it's a beautiful sunset it's been a long and tiring day and that is why Zazu is enjoying his bed and all tucked in in the blankie. Zazu, let's go eat. Zazu, Wally is also very, very tired. He's actually already asleep. We put his jacket on for extra warmth. Oh, sure you would be. Look at these tired munchkins. Happy campers. <laughs> 